Then we have the blush, which we just saw on Maria, also available in all sizes. All right, let's take a tour. You know what, I'm gonna move the, oh, I think you, you could see the detail here on the navy. First of all, faux leather. Now this leather, I will tell you, the technology and the, and the uh, manufacturing has come a long way. These faux leathers are really, really good. When you look at this at first glance, that looks like genuine leather, right? You see the graining in this, right? You see the almost kind of wrinkling in this, as you would see, or creasing as you would in a, in a genuine leather. But it's not, it's faux. And this faux is super soft. It has a nice hand to it. It's really comfortable. It's not plasticky, which back in the day, faux leathers, that was kind of the giveaway. They would make noise because they were like plastic. This soft, it's pliable, and has a soft hand to it. And let's talk details. When you look at this, I kind of see the classic denim jacket, chest pockets, that button front, the banding at the waist, all of those details, but this done with that Dennis Basso touch. The chest pockets, he did all a little bit of a smaller scale. These are functional, by the way. I don't think you'll actually use these pockets for anything, but if you wanted to, you can. The flap does open up. Notice he's taken that line from the faux pocket and extended the line past the pocket and has now incorporated this as a design detail. And this line, these lines taper and get narrower as they head down towards the bottom hem. The bottom hem banded, but it's not tight. On your classic denim jacket, remember that bottom band would be kind of tight across the hips. This, he's done more of a straight hem. That way it sits better, it hangs better. And then with the seaming detail, he's done an on-seam pocket as well. You do have your hip pockets. And then the stand collar. Instead of your traditional pointed collar, on the denim jacket, what he's done here is a stand collar. This gives it a bit more of, again, a modern feel, a little bit of that mandarin collar detail. And then I just want to point out the last feature here. You have a, the banded cuff with the functional snap uh, detail as well. That way you can open this up. If you wanted to, you can zhuzh, you can push back, you can turn back because the sleeve fully lined as well as the entire body of the jacket and the lining dyed to match the outside as well. $79.22, that's a featured price. This jacket new this month. We have all colors in all three, uh, I'm sorry, all sizes in all three colors, navy. Here's your taupe. And lastly, your blush. Let's check it out and talk fit on our ladies. I mean, when you think of a denim jacket, you can wear that with everything. Denim jacket with denim. You wear a denim jacket, whether it's with a little dress, you can see with a skirted look, that's what you'll do with this faux leather jacket. Here you see Brenda wearing it with her denim jeans, navy with the dark indigo jeans, and then she layered a neutral top underneath. And I love this collar because it allows you to pair this with beautiful blouses. You could do this with a turtleneck right now. And I would wear this faux leather jacket as my apparel piece. This wouldn't just be a jacket I put on to keep me warm. I would wear this jacket just like Brenda is and keep it on all day at the office. So cute. And because the faux leather is so soft and supple, you can push the sleeves up just as she has done. You can see Maria has turned back the cuff. If you do have, if you're petite, you can actually open the button, turn back the cuff. It looks very sharp and finished. And that blush is so soft and pretty. Think Easter's coming and we're gonna see all those pastel colors. I love that she did this with a skirted look, just to show you the versatility of this design. The seaming in the back helps to accentuate your waist. It's not a boxy shape, but notice it's not skin tight either. It doesn't, it's not too tight, and it's also not too short. Your traditional denim jackets, they can be a little bit on the short side, right? Barely meeting your waistband. Here you can see this is going to come down and meet you right about at your hip bone, which is nice. A262722 is your item number for this new jacket that just debuted this month from Dennis Basso. It's our faux leather snap front jacket with stand collar. This very clean. If you like the idea of the faux leather though, we still have coming up our beautiful perforated faux leather jacket. Totally different feel than this jacket. The other one, a definitely a more feminine feel. This one, 
This is a little bit more motorcycle mama, but the colors are nice and soft, which is nice as well. Uh, th this is one I think you will not be disappointed. It'll be a workhorse for you. There's so many different outfits that you'll be able to pair this with. You'll definitely get your money's worth, which is $79.22, which is our featured price today. And as far as care for faux leather, if you're wondering, okay, what's the catch? How do I take care of it? This is actually machine washable. And then you just hang it to dry, line dry. And it's not something that you wash every time you wear it. You wash as needed. You could even do a little spot cleaning. If you get something on it, you don't need to wash the entire thing. Maybe just kind of wipe and launder uh, where you might have any problems or stains. Three colors. You're seeing Maria in the blush, that soft pink tone. Brenda, she's wearing it in our navy. And then your last option will be the taupe, which is our soft neutral. Now, I do want to mention, we are looking ahead to spring and summer fashions. We don't have any faux furs in this show. But I know you're saying, Gabrielle, it is like two degrees outside. Many of these pieces, like I said, you'll wear right now, maybe as your apparel piece instead of an outerwear piece. Also, here's a quick look at the other jacket in faux leather that I told you was coming up later in the show. It's on four easy payments of about $20. This is what I meant by a little bit of a feminine edge to it because you have the perforation, the scalloping, the peplum back, a lot of details to talk about, and the colors, so pretty. Um, so you can see Maria, she put this on it pretty in pink. You know what this reminds me of, Maria? The movie Grease? You could be like a pink lady. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's like that, this, that shade of pink. Uh, Brisa. <laughs> yeah, definitely not Sandra J. He just has his goody two shoes. Look at me. I will tell you, I've seen that movie probably a gazillion times.